what is going on everybody welcome back to the channel welcome back to the program welcome back to the show i'm mace coming to you live all the way from the west coast of canada and today i asked my colleague once again and she is the one who actually introduced me to dimash kudabarian way back when that was like last year and I asked her today, so what have you been listening to? What, what's, what's on rotation in the car at home? And she mentioned that she saw this singer last year in Vancouver, British Columbia. She saw them live. And uh, she shared that with me. She shared this artist with me. Their name is Homayun Shajarian. And Homayun Shajarian is an Iranian classical music and classical crossover vocalist and a tombak player. Havaya Geria is one of his most famous songs. He has one daughter, Yasmin Shadjarian. So his biography, he was born in Tehran in a music dedicated family. He's the son of Muhammad Reza Shadjarian, the grand master vocalist of Persian traditional music. Upon his father's advice, he began studying knowledge of technique and rhythm under supervision of Nasser Far Hangfar, master of the tombak at Persian Handrum at the age of five. Afterwards, he also continued learning the tombak under Jamshid Mohebi's supervision. He commenced learning Persian traditional vocal avas at the age of 10 alongside his older sisters under the father's supervision and gained knowledge of avas techniques and voice producing. Simultaneously, he attended Tehran Conservatory of Music and chose Kamanshi as his professional instrument, as well as being tutored by Ardashir Kamkar. In 1991, he accompanied his father in concerts on Ava Music Ensemble in the U.S., Europe, and Iran, playing tombak from 1999 on. Started accompanying his father also on vocals. His first independent work, Nasimi Vassal, composed by Mohammad Javad Zarabian, was released on his 28th birthday in 2003. He performed a live stream concert on the 24th of May, 2020, during this current, you know what's going on. So, I laid the groundwork. I'm going in completely fresh. No no idea. No idea what to expect musically. I know it'll have that Persian uh, flavor to it. Um, you know, he's, he's an Iranian performer. So, I, I, I'm guessing it's in Farsi. But, let's go. Let's check it out. Open mind. Let's see what we want to get here. Music shares a universal strand which stretches from one side of the globe to the other side of the globe. And we can all share in that. So, yeah, let's check this out. If you have any recommendations, let me know. Let's go, people. We're in this together. Let's check this out. All right, so we got an animated music video to go along with it. It's like... That started quickly. Uh, you can hear sort of folk elements, the traditional musical elements in there, so... Whatever stringed instrument that is. Yes, Huh? Whatever stringed instrument that is, I, I find it intoxicating. It sounds fantastic. What's going on there? Some weird looking dudes. Talk about that shot for a second. That's a beautiful composition right there. Look at that shot. It's 
beautiful. So we have this gentleman, he's going in search of something. He went to this building and the stairway collapsed out from under him. So lyrically, thematically, symbolically, I've not really a total picture of what's going on, but music, I, I really enjoy it, man. It's cool. You can hear that traditional aspect to it, but it's very beautiful. And I don't know what these dudes are doing, these three gentlemen, but they look kind of nefarious. <laughs> Okay, I'm out of my depth. No idea what I'm watching here now. Animation's kind of scary, but we have a cat here. Very interesting. What are those? The vocals. Okay. <laughs> um So, very visually stimulating music video, extremely creative, with a lot of color, but I feel like there's some mythical storytelling going on here, which I just can't, uh, I can't really digest it, um, and I can't really uh, parse out exactly what was going on. Musically, it's really interesting. Like, I, like, I can feel it. That was an up-tempo song. It has some rock elements to it. Uh, the vocal was super unique. So, um, instrumentally, there's instrumentation, which I'm not familiar with, and sounds that I'm not familiar with. But, yeah, I'd like to hear some more. Um, this isn't a particular type of track. Which I think, like my colleague would, I pictured something much more mellow, much more soft, much more uh, relaxing. This was kind of up-tempo, which is not a bad thing, obviously. But just when she told me about it, I was like, this must be something that's very, very sensual, very, very uh, soothing to the mind. Uh, just very beautiful, flowing vocals is what I was expecting. But this was different. It had that traditional, uh, those stringed instruments. It was cool. It was cool. And the music video was just bonkers. Just crazy. Artistically, it was super, super detailed and intricate and stimulating. I just had no idea what was going on. It was kind of macabre at points. It's like, what's going on here? It's kind of scary, but beautiful at the same time. So, any of y'all 
have knowledge about this, let me know down below what was going on in the music video. And uh, yeah, that was interesting to say the least. We'll see you all soon. Peace out, my friends. Bye-bye.